The Treasure Coast tonight, Port St. Lucie police say this woman found a unique way to leave the hospital by stealing an ambulance. The investigators didn't have to work too hard to track her down. Ari Hyde is in Port St. Lucie with more on the hospital heist. Like most hospitals, you will see ambulances coming and going all day long here at HCA Florida St. Lucie Hospital. But one ambulance on Wednesday was being driven by a patient accused of stealing that ambulance. Police say this is Marquisa Allen. And they say this is the ambulance she stole. Allen was arrested on the Turnpike South in Martin County around 3.30 Wednesday afternoon. Police say her crime started at HCA Florida St. Lucie Hospital in Port St. Lucie. Check out this video from the hospital security camera. Investigators say that's Allen in a hospital gown sitting on the bench out front. She gets up, walks away. As she leaves the frame, you can still follow her in the reflection in the window. You see her walk by the parked ambulances and then pivot back. Police believe this is when she decided to steal the ambulance. A few seconds later, that ambulance can be seen driving away. Port St. Lucie Police Chief Richard Del Toro says the attendants had just taken a patient inside the hospital. What it comes down to really a crime of opportunity. I mean, they, they unfortunately they left the keys inside the vehicle. It's not clear if the engine was still running. What is clear is it wasn't hard for police to find that stolen ambulance. Unbeknownst to the suspect though, the vehicle does have GPS and they were able to track it to the turnpike southbound where it got caught up in some traffic. And that's where police took her into custody for a crime that is unusual, to say the least. I've never heard of somebody stealing an ambulance other than outside of a movie, uh, maybe The Fugitive or something like that. But um, yeah, pretty interesting case. Just when you think you see it all, it never ceases to amaze me. Allen is now charged with resisting arrest. Police say she ran through turnpike traffic trying to get away from them. They say she also gave them a fake name initially. Port St. Lucie police expect to charge her with Grand Theft Auto sometime on Friday. In Port St. Lucie, Ari Height, WPBF 25 News.